Again, we have no shirts on. I usually never have no shirt. Sorry. Though. Well, I can't really wear this because right now they can probably see through my heart because it's green. Yeah. Alright. Like, feel like a shawl. Let's get this moving. We're off in three, two, one. Getting it. Um. What are we doing, Jake? We are doing a rendition of the of a 2016 games workout called the Separator. Okay, is that what it's called? Yes. Okay, the last year I was there, we did this workout called the Separator. Um, at the games, I'll take the workout uh, that we're doing. We're doing 12, 9, 6 of parallel handstand push ups at 14 inch deficit. Um, so there's no ab mat below us, we're just using the parallels on a dollar mat. Um, and then 15 uh, back squats, and then it goes to, and there's 20 bar facing burpees. So it goes 12, 15, 20. And then it goes back to parallettes, and it goes nine. Then it goes 18 front squats at 205, so we're stripping the weight off. 225, 205, 20 bar facing burpees. Back to the wall for the last six parallel handstand push ups. Back to the bar for 21 overhead squats, 185, the worst part of the workout. And then 20 bar facing burpees. Uh, the games was technically a ring handstand push up, and the ring was actually from the higher rings from a muscle up position. Unfortunately, um, it's not really. A super cool movement to really practice. Um, we can both do it, and we don't have high rings. So had we done this workout, it would have been from low rings, and yeah. it's not. It's not the same. It's yeah. not the same. Like to have to do a muscle up every time you break, and then roll over into a ring handstand push up. So parallels, I thought was yeah, semi decent stuff. It's not. It's again. It's like three to four times as fast, but depending on how you what kind of judge you got that year. Well, I'm saying like the parallel, the parallel handstand push-up was a lot faster than the ring handstand push-up. Yeah. Because um, um, cool. if you go back and watch the, like that that year, there was definitely some gray area, heat to heat, person to person, on what they allowed. But anyways, the concept was like strict muscle ups. Yeah, it was, it was just kind of all over the place a little bit. So I thought to make it super easy and make it a little bit more just black and white. Make it a parallel and just call it call it good and. And I remember getting done with this workout in 2016, and I wasn't like dying because to be honest, like you spent a lot of time at the rings resting because you weren't going to like do a muscle up or one ring handstand push up like that's not worth it. Yeah. But in this workout, it's okay if you just want to do singles and parallels because you can just kick back up like sure. they're doing a muscle up. So this workout was a lot faster and a lot different than the games. Right. And the game, also, we don't have enough space to move the bars. I realized that the games, they moved the squat uh, twice on your back, um, or maybe three times, I don't even know. But they moved it even with the bars on your back. We don't have the ability to do that with our floor, the camera, like we just yeah. did it all in one spot. So it's good, it's good, dude. So, it's fine. Uh, I think at the games, I don't remember how I broke my hands, that push it doesn't really matter. But I think I went, I'm um, broken the back squats, which we both did today. And then I think everyone approached the front squat thinking, oh yeah, I could definitely do these 18 front squats so broken I know, at 205. No, no. No one did it in broken. Off the count, but well, I think I, I know what I did. I think I did, I think I had six left. I think I did 12 and six. Yeah, I went 11 and seven. Okay, so similar. Yeah. You got to the point where you're like, I think I could do it. And you got like 10, you're like, I can't do it. I'll give it a couple more. And you're like, I'm done. Yeah, I mean, if you're someone that's obviously is very good at the handstand push-up, like Jake is, you're gonna move through that part really quick, uh, and then you're obviously gonna be on your way with the barbell a little bit more. Myself, first round fell okay, then I str I struggle with higher volume, like keep going multiple sets of that kind of stuff. So like, I had to break the handstand push-up in the second set and the third set, just to kind of save myself. And then I thought I could do the front squats unbroken, and that was a pipe dream. So I dropped that. It just got rough. It was not. Uh, it didn't feel good from the beginning. So we just grind but, it out and finish. But a solid workout. It's a lot faster. It wasn't like a, there was no place that you were really. The only place you were really resting was if you broke your parallel handstand push-ups, and if you. I mean, when you broke your squats. Yeah, if you broke, we bar broke bar. our squats. Yeah, that 185 for 21 is. Yeah, but that was the worst part. Is the worst part is like. You do your 20 bar facing burpees, it's you roll the bar forward, you go back and hit six parallel hands, which doesn't matter who you are, but that's gonna be pretty quick compared to your 12. And then you're back to stupid 21 overhead squats, you're like, I just pressed out for a great parallel hands that push ups. Yeah, for sure. That was definitely the, the roughest part, just with all the pressing in a row. That's yeah. what it was. And yeah. then having to support it on the shoulder. Yeah. Like you can rest, obviously, the back squat, just rest, if you take a rest, it's just sitting on your back, that's not a big deal. 
front squat's a little bit even harder because now it's in the front. You're not going to sit there with the front rack no. and try to do it, so you'll drop that. And then you're definitely not going to sit there with it overhead. <laughs> so, hey guys, I'm just going to hold this here. Yeah, that was definitely the roughest part of of the workout. So, you look pretty good though. Yeah, I look, I look solid, you know, I'm looking good. I'm, right now I'm feeling really bad for myself, I'm thinking, gosh, this really sucks. I should have just finished like, that. Well, like, I think he's already done with his front squats. I'm just, I'm just resting. Yeah. I'm just going to sit here before I do some burpees. Definitely I'm getting, getting mentally prepared for burpees. Definitely rough. I needed Jake Flo next to me, so I had something to struggle with right here. <laughs> <laughs> hey Jake, you need to slow hey, down. Jake, we just, we just, let's do this together. I don't remember the actual rules in the games. There was, act, I remember the, the, the rules are really weird on when you could change your bar weight. Yeah, you could. You, I, I didn't give him any specific direction. He could just change it whenever. Like I said, we just wanted to make this workout as black and white as possible. As fast. Yeah, yeah. And, and just go and. I had to go get a towel because my hands were just soaked. I was like, man, is he just going to go do something different? He's like, yeah, I was like, gonna I'm going to run. Run. sub a run in for front squats. <laughs> I had to go get a hand towel because my like, parallettes were soaked. My hands were soaked. Well, it's, guys, it's humid back in Kansas. Yeah. yeah. There's a fan going right next to me right here. Like, literally could like feel my hands slipping. Like, that's how wet the parallettes were. So it's just getting that time of year. So. But it's good to practice because, you know, it's hot outside of games and it gets sweaty and if you got to use a barbell there too and it's good to work on. If you got to use a barbell there. Right. <laughs> a game, a game like I honestly felt really nice through my first like probably seven to eight front squats. I was like, oh, let's just keep, uh, yeah, it's 20 pounds lighter. Yeah, let's keep rolling. And then you just get about halfway, a little over halfway and you're like, oh my God. <laughs> uh, so what's a good sub for females? Uh, 225 back squat is going to be a 150 back squat for the female. I'm almost positive uh, for you guys. Yeah, and then you would just obviously subtract weight off the bar. So you'd go probably 150, 130, uh, 135, and then 125. Yeah, 125. 25? Yeah. So to make it easy for you guys, you could literally go 150. 130, 120. That would be super simple because then you're just taking off tens and fives, whatever. Yeah. It's not like having to do a bunch of change plate stuff. Yeah. So, um, um, what about the deficit for the parallel? Because I mean, I think 14 inches is it's aggressive for ladies. So I would definitely say at an ab mat or two. Um, I think usually it's like ten, eight to ten inches. Eight to ten them. inches. So like if you added two ab mats, that would probably be appropriate for the parallel. Um, I, what if, are you doing right now? I'm resting. Oh, you, 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 oh, you're resting your front squat. I thought you were resting for a burpee. No. And then obviously, you guys, um, if you need, you'll, you'll see that in my notes, but like change the handstand push up to something that you can at least make some sets on, right? Like, like did you do your first 12 unbroken? I did, yeah. So maybe the goal should be like your first 12 should be. My, my initial thought, because I always go next to Jake and then I do th something completely different than what I wanted to do, I always want, I wanted to try and two set all of them. Like, that was my goal. From the get go, which I did do, I did two set all, well, two setted the ones I, I didn't break up. So I went 12 unbroken, I two setted the nine, and then I two setted the six. Mm -hmm. So, like, you know, I, I was able to at least keep that kind of a pace. That's kind of like what you're looking for so that you're not stuck at the wall for three plus minutes doing singles. That would probably be rough, mm -hmm. you know. Yeah. You want to at least be able to get back to the bar and get on the bar quickly. Cool. Well, I don't really have anything else to say. You want to watch your overhead squat? No. Oh, uh, that's next for me, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, dude. Let's watch a few and then we'll we'll call it because <laughs> nobody wants to. I don't want to watch my twenty burpees. I know I started out fast and then I stopped. I was so mad at you for yelling me at me during my. Well, you were going so slow. What? I was gassed. <laughs> well, so was I. Good, good gravy here. I'm gonna start doing that. Look at me, dude. Look at me. I'm just chilling before I walk over there. I should have yelled at you right now. I'm like, yeah, what are you doing? Putting a belt on. Good gravy transition. We've only been working on that for 28 weeks. It's no big deal. <laughs> I'm like, I'm gonna take my son. I'm just gonna walk up this I side. thought maybe, just maybe. Oh, wait, oh, yeah, there's Brent. He's going up. Oh, he's gone already. Okay. There's <laughs> Matt over there. He's gone too. Okay. <laughs> I thought maybe, just maybe, I could do these unbroken. What did you set it at? I it? did I did two sets, but I don't remember. They look good, man. What they actually were. Um, Three. I think I was it twenty one. Yeah. I think I did fifteen. That's pretty good. I did more. I did more in my second set. Than I did my first set. <laughs> <laughs> that's like the worst. That's like the the biggest thing uh, I tell people is don't do that. I know, but I just I just had a struggle. You were like, I'm just gonna finish this out. Yeah. All right, cool. I don't have anything to say really. No, so. it was a good little practice workout, and it's good to kind of. It's not comparable because they're not doing the ring hands and push up, but at least you can get an idea. And honestly, though, in a way. 
we knew it could be faster. So if he was at over his time from there, then I knew we got a problem, which he wasn't, so we're good. So. Yeah, because I think if the game goes 14, 14 we 52. 40, 52? Yeah. Well, you know my time. I didn't yeah. know it. Yeah. It's 14 something. There's only like a handful of guys, like maybe three more or four more after you in the low. It must have been time capped at 16 because yeah. Uh, yeah. there's only like three guys after you, then everybody else was capped. Yeah. So not a lot of guys finished that. It's called, it's called separator. Yeah. Cool. All right, I got nothing else to say. Appreciate you guys watching. Talk to you guys later. See you guys. Yeah.